Aqua Nerdigans. This is the one only Packer Girl 89 and today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Platinum End Chapter 45. So this is going to be really, really heartbreaking um, because we have this final fight with uh, um, Mirai and Saki uh, before the final fight and everything else. So let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. So Chapter 45 is titled Measure of Sentiment. I came here on the very first day I got my wings. It's beautiful. Kakashi, I love you. Yay! Thank you. God, I love this art so much. I'm glad that you and I are still alive. Yeah. Oh, there's that motherfucker to cut. Uh, oh my God. Um, that fucking motherfucker, Yoneda. That motherfucker i hate him so much hate what he did to my man um the metropolitan police and the Na national police agency correct and that's yabe on the cell phone um the seven top police officials were already under the control of red arrows that would be red's work then um given what happened to that other candidate it's a natural psychological response to want to protect yourself i wouldn't be surprised if they tried to get rid of the minister of defense as well only uh for you to have beaten them to the punch mr prime minister don't worry they won't uh, don't want to start a uh um a war they just want to keep the dialogue going i would like our little arrangement announced as soon as possible i understand they're taking a long time i'm worried about uh kakahashi it hasn't it hasn't even been three hours yet Good grief, where have they gone? Maybe the two of them flew off to escape. There's definitely something going on between them. No, Kakahashi would never do something like, Kakahashi this, Kakahashi that. I know Red has his arrow in you, but this guy on, on guy stuff is kind of hard to take. Miss Tamari, that's awfully close to discrimination against gay people. <laughs> huh? Look, personal preferences and tastes are not discrimination. My only romantic interest is in men, that's all. If you ask me, the next god uh, should do something about all this hysteria about claiming harassment and discrimination. Yes, thank you! I love it! Thank you! Thank you, Tamari! Thank you for saying this shit! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Tamari is saying the next god should get rid of political correctness is, is what she's saying. Thank you, Tabari. That makes me happy. D discrimination is a social back, a social system backed by the powerful, like slavery, slavery or anti-Semitic uh, persecution or apartheid um, or whatever. Uh, wait, apartheid or whatever. Excuse me. It's how, that's how it. Uh, that's how it goes. Um, it starts when someone in power says, "I don't like those people, so let's make their life miserable for them." Oh, this is so true. Preach, Tabari. Preach. When Metropoli Man said, if I'm God, I'll kill all the poor and uglies, that's discrimination. Are you going to say that swiping left on or right on a, on a dating app is the same thing? At that point, it would be an act of discrimination to refuse a marriage proposal. I said it was hard to take, not creepy. Legalize gay marriage before you start coming after me. <laughs> Tamari is spouting wisdom. She's just spouting wisdom right now. She's, she's got a point. At any rate, I need red arrows because I only like hot guys with money. That's why I need someone to be God so they can let me have them. Dude, that's a fucking shallow shit right there. At least she recognizes it. It's from the Commissioner General. Uh, this, the Prime Minister is making a special announcement at 9 o'clock. That's one hour from now. I'm guessing he's not uh, announcing the legalization of gay parents. <laughs> we should let uh, Kakahashi and um, Hanakako know about this. Why don't you call them then? The cod-chasing process, as it is known among the public, has caused has been causing an uproar at uh, home and abroad. It is not a story, but fact. The god candidates are real. Um, one of the candidates is uh, Total University uh, press, uh, Professor um, Emeritus Gaku Yoneda. Dr. Yoneda has requested that the government provide a safe place for dialogue. Um, after more than a dozen meetings with the government, we have agreed to this request, and we have decided to offer the god candidates the use of the construction site of the new national stadium for their discussion. New national stadium? What is this? Is my show not going to air this week? It's an important announcement we should watch. It is scheduled for October 10th at 1 p.m. In one week? Is the Prime Minister just Dr. Yoneda's slave now? Yeah, but he's the world-famous Yoneda. The government's desperate. There are no tourists uh, flying in anymore. Yeah, and there are protests happening all over. We need to put an end to all this craziness. Some countries are even threatening to boycott the Tokyo Olympics if a J uh, Japanese person becomes god. That's ridiculous. Someone just got shot by a sniper and they're going to announce uh, this a week in advance? For safety purposes, everything within a kilometer of the site will be declared an evacuation zone. 
and uh, any who do not heed this order will be escorted out by police and self-defense force officers. Is an evacuation order worse than an evacuation recommendation? Yep. Lastly, I have a, mes a message from Dr. Gaku Yoneda himself. I'm Gaku Yoneda. In the past week, I've listened to people from all over the world, not just Japan. I believe that the majority of them are in favor of my point of view. There is no need for God in the modern world, and certainly not a false God. This consensus is only natural. Unfortunately, there was an interruption forcing us to call off our discussion. I will admit that there is a certain logic to the idea of simply killing all the God candidates. A supersonic bullet from a blind spot is something even a candidate cannot evade if um, he doesn't know it's coming. However, if there is a sing even a single second's gap between the deaths of all the God candidates, the last one is assured to become the false God and survive the attempt. You must not attempt to kill the God candidates. Leave this matter up uh, to us, the candidates. We will air the entirety of our discussion and bring, to, uh, bring it to an acceptable conclusion. I will see you again at the new National Stadium construction site on October 10th. It will finish on October 10th. Uh, well, if he says so. Yoneda's got a red arrow in the Prime Minister, I believe. Correct. Um, at this point, uh, how can how much can we really trust either the government or Dr. Yanena? This is basically guaranteed to be a trap. Actually, I think that what, this really is Dr. Yanena giving us a safe place to talk. I agree. He wouldn't need to do that because he has absolute confidence in himself, which is why I'm saying we'll never convince him of anything. You never know until you try. Don't you get it? This red, the red arrows are, aren't the only reason I'd want someone to be God. If one of us doesn't become God, there, then there's no way uh, to wipe away the God-choosing process in the candidates, is there? Am I right, uh, Yazeli? That is correct. If that's the case, then I can't speak for Dr. Yuneda, but I know that none of the rest of the God can candidates will ever find happiness. Maybe not. In the end, the best way is to kill Dr. Yuneda. But, I, and you have to wonder, though, if that is what Dr. Yuneda wants. Because remember, Yuneda said like a, a few chapters back that he wants to die. This is what he wants. He wants to die anyway. So, but that makes us no different um, from Metropolitan Man. We've been trying so hard not to go that route. We can't be happy. Um, Kakahashi? False God or not, this isn't just for the sake of those who need God. Um, there's also the happiness of those who were chosen to be candidates. If no matter how much we talk or how persuasive our arguments are, Dr. Yoneda still doesn't agree to allow a God candidate to be God. Oh, God. He will, he will have to die. Exactly! That's what he wants! Dr. Yoneda wants to die! He wants to die! Dr. Yoneda is going to have to die, but he wants to die! That's what he wants! He wants to die anyway, so this is a win-win situation for him. And I think that, um, I'm very curious what you guys think is if, uh, Dr. Yoneda knows he's going to die. Very curious what you guys think. This is what, I think this is all going according to Yoneda's plan. That he's, he knows he's gonna die. He wants to fucking die. Just let him goddamn die. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Platinum End content, upgrade my equipment, um, actually have a place to live, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, from me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below. Um, until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.